Recall your school days. What did you do to look all cool and out there? Carry a mobile phone, a camera to your school, right? Now come back to the present. What do you think youngsters do today to get that cool check pass? This. It has become popular that the ones who could not make benzene rings in chemistry class are now becoming cool by making rings out of a vape. Despite those warnings outside the cigarette packets, the world still became habitual of it. And today the situation stands where one out of every five men is into smoking and one woman in every 10 has become used to it. Going by these trends, tobacco will be the cause of death for about 250 million people in the near future. Gone are the days when smoking was considered to be a taboo. That is not the case, at least for tier 1 cities of the country. When smoking cigarettes became common, youngsters had to find another way to look all cool, elite and exclusive. And vape happened. In a generation where everyone is smoking a cigarette, vape is like a Tesla. A new product that is destroying the market. It's like if you can't make a relationship with a cigarette, then make a situationship with this. But how did vape become so popular? Initially, vapes were marketed as a safer alternative to smoking and that gained all the traction. Vape was also hassle-free as one did not need to light it like a cigarette. You could just keep it in your pocket like a pen and smoke it wherever you felt like. No smell from your mouth meant it could be used without the worry of your parents noticing some weird smell. There's no need to find a smoking zone when you have a vape. Just carry it like a pen, use it or pass it wherever you feel convenient. Also, it came in so many fruity flavours which gave a free pass of a good taste. Where many people did not like the taste of a cigarette, vapes were all fruity and better tasting. All of these factors were enough to build a craze for the product and soon the craze got into addiction. Multiple news reports show how vapes are now being seized from schools and this is not the case with just one or two schools. It is becoming widely common throughout the country. Vape is not just a mere trend anymore, it has become a culture. A culture so disturbing that some countries have even legalized it, while the others are promoting it. Vaping products were the fastest growing category in the United Kingdom for the second year in 2023. A while back, there were reports that 1 million free vapes were distributed in UK for people just to help them to quit smoking. Today, the market value of e-cigarettes stands at about 20 billion US dollars and it is estimated that this value would cross 54 billion US dollars by the year 2027. Vapes, which are marketed as healthier alternatives, how do they work and how are they any better from traditional cigarettes? E-cigarette was invented by a Chinese pharmacist in 2003 with a single motive behind the product that even captured minds, which was to replace the traditional smoking technique. The functioning of a vape is pretty simple. There's a battery, an atomizer and a cartridge inside. In this cartridge, a nicotine or non-nicotine liquid just sometimes is inserted. When we turn it on, the battery heats up the liquid in the cartridge and then the atomizer converts it into a mist or vapor. And this for you is vaping, my dear friends. While all those self-proclaimed health experts claim that vape is helpful in reducing smoking, let me tell you that this is just a misconception. However, the reality is that with e-cigarettes, the number of smokers has just gone up. And a reason for that is the accessibility of using a vape. Variety of flavours it comes in and vape comes with nicotine. So eventually, they cannot stay away from the nicotine addiction. The case of people shifting from vape to cigarettes is more common than the other way around. As the old saying goes, when I hear about the dangers of smoking, I give up hearing. 
If you are a vape person, you might feel like you want to stop this video right now. But don't. You need to know this. The sentence that vaping is healthy is completely false. And there's no study till date that says so. Even the FDA has not approved it. Nicotine is the primary agent in regular cigarettes and e-cigarettes and is a toxic substance. It raises your blood pressure and spikes your adrenaline, which increases your heart rate and even the likelihood of having a heart attack. Harmful chemicals present in a vape pose the risk of lung diseases and cardiovascular diseases. Vapes are even known to affect brain development in teenagers. Vaping is known to cause life-threatening problems in certain people. And in fact, there's a term known for it in the market called Iwali, which is e-cigarette and vaping use associated lung injury. These all effects come from short-term vape usage. We have no idea about the long-term effects. Those are yet to be studied. Increased vaping and the unknown consequences pose a grave threat to the health of our youth. It has been linked to higher risk of progressing into a cigarette smoking world. Higher concentrations of nicotine and THC are becoming available to the youth consumer with unknown prevalence and effects. And vaping has become the biggest gateway to smoking in the current date. While there are countries promoting vaping culture, in India it is banned. In 2019, the government brought out the Prohibition of Electronic Cigarettes Act, where e-cigarettes or vapes were banned. So for all of you who like making those smoke rings out of your vapes, just know that vape is illegal. And if you want to look cool, it is a choice. But if caught, then the first-time offenders can face one year in prison and get a fine of up to rupees 1 lakh. And repeated offenders will have to serve three years in jail with a fine of 5 lakhs. Now, although the government has banned it, has that made any difference in the scenario? Do you not see people smoking a vape outside? Firstly, the openness with which they are sold. Hardly a few know that they are illegal. And most of our cherished platforms with the most famous influencers are exposing us to all of these products. It is not just making us feel positive about these products, but is also increasing our intent to use such products. The tobacco industry in India at present stands over rupees 11 lakh crore. And the number of tobacco users in India is huge. India, in fact, is the second largest tobacco market in the world. While it took for us decades just to understand the lethal effects of smoking tobacco, which still kills over 8 million people annually, this problem of vaping should not be ignored or normalized at all. The problem of drug abuse in our country is expected to explode in the next 10 to 17 years of age groups. And this time, these seemingly harmless party habits will be the major contributor to all of this explosion that will for sure spoil the future of this country.